Hello again, uh, back again with another quick batch file tutorial. Today we're going to be doing uh, substring searching in batch. So let me just quickly get this set up and then we'll dive right back in. Okay, I'm back. So let's set up our variables for this. So let's do set string, or let's just do hello world. Okay. And then let's set the variable uh, that's going to contain the substring we want to search for. Uh, let's have it look for the character L right now. Jesus, autocorrect. Okay, and now let's do the command. We're going to use a find string command. Uh, it's not very commonly used in batch, but this is a perfect uh, perfect example to use it. So we're going to do, uh, we're going to crunch the command with a couple other intricacies of batch so that we can make it more optimized and smaller for us to use. So let's do echo. Uh, we're going to do the string that you want to search through, string, or operand, find string, forward slash c colon, you might recognize this from uh, choice, from the old choice command. Now let's do within uh, quotes, we're going to do the substring. And then we're going to push it to null, because we don't want to output anything. And then if this successfully runs, and, and, uh, we can do our command, you know, we can call something or do whatever. Well, I'm just going to have echo, I'm just going to say, uh, I'm just going to have it say, uh, character match found. Remember, you have to use two exclamation points for the escape character. Pause. Okay. So, what should happen is that because the character L is found one, two, and three times within the string hello world, or at least once, uh, we should get character match found printed out. Let's find out if it works. It does not. Oh. Oh my gosh, how could... <sighs> Let's try that again. Character match found. Okay, so now this is substring, so we can also do something like this. We can say substring match found, and let's say I want to find hello. Hello is found. Now let's do something that's not in there. Let's do like a, there is no character A. Nothing is printed. So that's how you do a uh, very simple substring searching in batch. Uh, in another video, I will do something very similar to this and something I personally use uh, for C and D Rogue. See you later.